Yes, students, welcome back into my another video. Uh, I will discuss here the most important questions of uh, elements of electrical engineering. Subject code is uh, BEEP 103 or 203. Okay, I will discuss here first the passing modules, then after uh, I will take the rest of the two modules. Okay, uh, first module 4 it is the passing module. Okay, in which you can easily score 20 marks by covering these important questions like uh, with a neat diagram and truth table, explain two way and three way control of lamp. Okay, explain the construction and working of Kelvin's double bridge with a neat diagram, explain working of a mega right short note on domestic wiring. And with neat diagram, explain working principle of Wheatstone bridge. Explain the construction of Maxwell's bridge and derive the expression for unknown inductance. And uh, with neat sketch, explain current and potential transformer. Okay, these six questions are enough to cover the module fourth. That is why I call it the module. Sorry, passing module. Uh, less numericals uh, you will see uh, from the previous year papers. Okay, so better to go for these theoretical concepts. You will easily score. 20 marks okay next is module 5 which is again a passing module in which you have to cover some super important questions like what is earthing uh, with a neat diagram explain pipe earthing and pallet earthing okay with a neat circuit diagram explain the operation of earth's leakage circuit breaker that is elcb and write a short note on mcp uh, miniature circuit breaker and fuse okay list their merits and demerits sometimes they will ask you for the uh, structure also with a neat diagram explain mcb over the year okay so next i will take here <coughs> define see here define unit and uh, use it for consumption of electrical energy and explain the two-part tariff with its advantage and disadvantages what are the safety precautions which should be taken to avoid uh, sorry which should be taken to avoid uh, this electric shock okay i have missed this one so avoid electric shock electric shock okay next is write a short note on rccb okay it is not rcb royal challengers Bangalore. it is rccb okay list out the power rating of household appliance appliances uh, including air conditioners pcs laptops and printers find total power consumed okay next is this much is uh, enough to cover module uh, fifth okay next is module first in which some numericals are also there so theoretical concepts are like state and explain kirchhoff's law uh, and you have to go through uh, through its numericals based on the Kirchhoff's law. Okay. Next is a uh, state and explain Ohm's law and what are its limitations. State and explain Lenz's law also, and explain Faraday's laws of electromagnetic induction. Derive an expression for energy stored in inductor. Derive an expression for mutually induced EMF. And write a short note on concepts of self and mutual inductance. Okay. So you should go through numericals of the first chapter that is on the Kirchhoff's law. Okay. Where you are supposed to calculate the current and voltage okay so that are simpler ones so better to go for first part numericals uh, you can leave second chapter means electromagnetism so you can uh, leave the magnetic numericals over here okay so this much is enough to cover model first then we come with the model third uh, with the circuit diagram and phasor diagram show that two watt meters are uh, sufficient to measure three phase power okay super important question in a three phase star connection find the relation between line and phase values of current and voltage also derive the equation for three phase power okay next is uh, what is necessity of three phase power and write down its advantages and sometimes they will ask you the expression for three phase power relationship between line and phase values of delta connection it was the star connection it is delta connection okay and some numericals if you are convenient go through the numerical part so sometimes it is easy to pass uh, this electrical subject with a theory only but i cannot give the assurity just because it is uh, like uh, 60 40 60 means uh, theoretical part and 40 means numerical part but sometimes vt is asking unexpected papers they may give you the 50 50 or sometimes uh, 60 40 means 60 means numerical and uh, 40 means theoretical part okay so better to uh, consider numericals also that will be uh, sorry you will be on the safer side later on okay next is model second that is derive the relation between v and i when ac is supplied to rl series series circuit and R rlc series circuit okay draw phasor diagram define the following terms like average value rms value form factor peak factor apparent power and reactive power show that the power consumed in a pure capacitive circuit is zero with the help of voltage current and power waveforms and show that voltage and current are in phase with each other in pure resistive circuit okay this is all about theoretical portion from model second if you are convenient uh, you can go through the numerical part also
which I mentioned here 40, 60, 60, 40. So it is up to you now. If you just go through these important questions, we can easily concur this subject. Okay. So better to clear this subject in the earlier attempts. Okay. This is the subject among those in which most of the students from uh, previous schemes, okay, they are still struggling to pass the electrical subject. So I wish you, uh, you should pass the subject in the first attempt, okay. So my best wishes are with you and uh, make sure you will share this important video to all your friends who actually need it. Thank you.